what is up you beautiful amazing incredible human being stepping by to watch this video welcome back to my channel hey what's going on so jujitsu kaisen episode four and five let's just dive straight into it if you like jujitsu kaisen hit the like button subscribe so that you stay up to date and notifications so that you know exactly when it drops let's jump into this hidden inventory four i don't know why they all called this but let's just watch uh the last episode this broke my heart i swear uh Ah, it doesn't change. I feel so bad for her. She finally made her own decision. Now, I think that this is going to drive Ghetto insane. And Fushiguru, you know, that's his job, you know, what he was hired to do. But he's, incre he's incredible. He's just so smart. Megumi's father, I'm guessing at this point. Oh, yeah, and Gojo's completely butchered. Man, JJK. This is how they're gonna start. Oh, he's in his mouth. In the dragon's mouth. That's the same dragon that we saw that was next to the plane. And he's not even a cursed user, which is very interesting. As I was saying, uh, they were talking about Heaven's Impact and the Spear of Heaven. and Or Heaven's Pact, I mean, sorry. So I don't know what that's about. Oh, because it's forbidden, they can't place guards there. So if you know where the doors are, you can just get in. So that's what I'm saying. His knowledge is what gets him these victories. Ah, right. No cursed energy, so they can't detect him. Oh. So what does he do with his cursed item? Or does that mean he can't have any on him? He only has that gun now. Oh, he, give... he swallows it. Oh my goodness. Oh. So because it's inside his body, which is a non-cursed energy, it's a barrier for his cursed tool. And he shrinks it down, keeps it in his stomach, and then throws it up, regurgitates it. Oh, right. Heavenly Pact. This guy is like a detective. She's probably dead. Wow. This guy is crazy. And this is Megumi's father. So I'm guessing. Let's go get her. I'm still interested to see what this heavenly pact is about. And how would you even acquire something like that? Very interesting. Oh. So where's Tengen in all of this? The rainbow dragon. That rainbow dragon has the toughest skin, I think it said. This whole place is about to fall down. Riffraff to his, to his techniques. Almost like a child's play. Is that Tengen? Am I pretty? A potential apparition. Oh, this is what Ghetto just used. You're not my type. Oh, it took his ear off. It's over. Oh, he's gonna take his creature. Wow. Something's gonna happen though. Oh, maybe the heavenly pack blocks it. Oh my gosh, bro. This guy's OP. He's got a counter for everything. Wow. Oh, he might release it all over the world. Oh. A monkey like me. Remember Ghetto always says that. He calls them monkeys in like the, in the like newer day or in the movie Zero. Like he kept calling like human beings monkeys. Magumis. Now he remembers all of a sudden. Wait, is Ten? So my whole idea was that Tengen was going to either use like Ghetto's body as the vessel. But now I'm looking at this. It might be Ghetto's body because, you know, he's still alive and there's blood spilled. Oh my goodness, he brought a whole body there. 
all four limbs intact but she's dead though it was like 30 million or something so they just taking the body creeps what is in this guy's forehead その傷に Wow, these guys seem like they've lost their minds. I mean, there's a lot that he said. Exactly. There's a lot that he said, but it just, it's just not good news. Either for work or in hell. So like, there's a lot that was mentioned here. I'm actually just a little bit more shocked at like everything that's taken place, you know. Gojo, we haven't seen him yet, but he got destroyed. Oh my gosh, he's there? Wait, what? I'm alive and kicking. Reverse curse technique. When he stabbed me through the throat, I gave up on counter attacking. He's hot. <laughs> oh my gosh. So now he's basically like, he's rushing now. Oh my Gojo looks like a madman. And if he wins this, he's gonna go inside the building and destroy everyone. Oh my gosh. Red. Oh, we never saw this one before. Wow, let's go, Gojo. Let's go, Gojo. Look at him, dude. He's like divine. Bro, I said, I, did I not ask the question when I said, is Gojo not a god? <laughs> okay, now I'm starting to see a bit more clear. Yeah, that, so it's what I was saying. One is to stop things. The second one is to attract. And the third one is to repel. Something's off. This is the first time you're seeing actual fear in Fushiguro. What? This is like in a dream. Man, I'm an I Riku. I bear no grudge against anyone. This guy is in ultimate bliss after being brought to death almost. It's like he's become everything. And he looks like a madman throughout heaven and earth. Oh my gosh. Wow. Gojo. Whoa, this dude is everything right now. He's fusing them. Hollow purple. Oh no. You're dead. Oh my gosh, like you, you stand no chance. Hollow purple. <laughs> what is going on? Oh! Finished. Oh my goodness. Wow. Any last words? Man, Gojo is... I have no words for him. Megumi. I wonder if he knows that Gojo killed his dad. Wow. Holy smokes. Oh my goodness. I know my light is bugging. I mean, there's literally so much that just went on there. We saw the, the crazed guy. He wasn't even the president of that religious group. A lot there, a lot happened there that I like just completely went over my mind or over my head. I was just so taken back. But Gojo, my goodness, man. Hollow purple. And 
I'm actually speechless. Let's just jump into the next episode, man. This show is so good. My goodness. One year later. Oh my goodness. Interesting. So they've just done a complete time skip. So now his whole technique and everything has just improved. And now it's been a year since that incident. Oh, so he doesn't get as tired. Because remember, that was the big issue, right? Is that if he uses it, he's like, he's done for some time. Domain expansion. This guy is OP. Satoru has become the strongest. Is this why Ghetto turns on him? So immediately there's this premature death. Immediately there's this separation now. Like Gojo is the pinnacle of it all. Springing up like maggots. And he's just consuming, consuming, consuming more and more and more. Like does that not have an effect on him? Like he said. Like shit and yeah, that's the same thing he said last time. A dirty rag. Who am I doing this for? So now he's got this sort of affirmation that he keeps talking over himself. You know, he's using those same words. But it's this, he's this, it's this pool. Like, what am I doing? Like, he's walking the ra the razor's edge. Like, he could tip at any point. But he's actually losing his mind. And this is kind of what I like to see. Because now we, we can actually understand. Oh, damn monkeys. Is this the first person he kills? Now we see his hair long, loose, I mean. You can, I don't know, you can already feel that he's not even the same anymore. This is crazy. This is actually crazy. The fact that going back in time and showing all of this makes the whole show a thousand times better. What kind of woman is your type? Oh, I'm not a... What did he say? Like, he's a good judge of character, but he can't even pick up Ghetto. Special grade. Who never accepts any mission. Good for nothing. Wandering around abroad. Interesting. Interesting. If everybody was a jujitsu sorcerer, no curses would be born. Because they would be able to control it. So nothing would leak out and, you know, take shape in the world. The rain sounds amazing. So why is she, so she's a bad person, I guess. Cause why is she she's got her own sort of agendas and things. Wow, that was there's so much information that is being brought to light. I'll have to watch again to really understand it fully, but madness. Tengen is stable. So these, it's like the, these types of vessels are just used as that. Bottles for holding Tengen, essentially. So whether you live or die, there's another one here. But yet they still put you on these missions to get it done. Crazy. The law in this season has been deep. Look at his eyes. Look at the, the dark rings around his eyes. Oh, he got killed on that mission. What is this now? These two are crazy. Like I said, he's at this crossroads. But he's gonna wipe out the whole village. Wow, 112 people were killed. And now he's been sentenced to death because his residue of his cursed energy was found. So he finally lost his mind, essentially. Not lost his mind, but he, he decided which way he was gonna go. You know, because sometimes not making a decision is making a decision. Not sometimes, it is. Oh my gosh, now he looks like that ghetto that we saw. Why does he seem so relaxed for some reason? And she's just gonna call them to say, I've got him right here. I don't want to get killed. <laughs> But it's almost like this burden is off his chest. Like, after he killed 112 people, he's just relaxed. He knows what he wants now. Is he gonna fight Gojo? <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> disappeared already. Well, obviously he's still caught up because it was his friend. So that's basically red. He'll just like shoot it at the back of his head. Wow, crazy. It's almost like so much to absorb that it's like I'm I'm speechless right now. But I, I can I can see where everything is coming from. You know, it also does make sense on the side of that things would be easier if everybody was a sorcerer. Um, but at the same time, you can't just be killing all these people. You know, how many, where are you going to stop? Where are you going to draw the line? Oh, now he's wearing that, those robes that we see him in. Are those not the two? Remember, I think it's in the movie. There's those two chicks who, like the one uses her cell phone or something. She was using a phone a lot. I think this is them when they were younger. Oh. Many objected to what he said. Oh, he's lost it completely. Wow. Megumi. Oh, this is when he was a kid. <laughs> Get stronger. Oh, this is. Wait, what? Oh my gosh! It's a Dory! Wait! Wait! Are they going back to the normal time? I don't know what's going on anymore. Oh my gosh, wait. Are they going back to the present day? <laughs> oh my gosh, this is amazing. Are they going back to the present day? This is insane. It's a Dory. This is I was I was so disappointed that they were doing the 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 i guess the flashback going back in time but look how much information we got to the to everything think about it if you watched season one season one was incredible you learned about cursed spirits and jiu-jitsu sorcerers and how that's like the superpowers that they actually have is by manipulating these spirits right so it was like wow this is cool but you had no idea like where everything like came from you had like sukuno who was this guy from like hundreds of years ago and that's why he had like these special grade items you know it was his fingers but it was kind of like they just left it to the imagination now you went back to see like who goja was and how ghetto became who he was because he is sort of you know he's the main bad guy in this whole thing and now you i mean you see that where everything stems from between him and ghetto right but then now they're going back to the present now you have all this information to now base everything everything on so now ah uh, there's just so uh, like i was actually i didn't have a lot to say during that episode because it was this information overload but what we did see is how things actually did affect ghetto and rightfully so i mean look at what he had to deal with and just walking this razor's edge where it's like people who are non-users are actually just a liability because they're the ones who are like actually causing all these cursed spirits to take place because they can't control it it, it leaks out into the world and if you were an uh, actual sorcerer you could just stop it you would be aware of it you'd be able to see them you'd be able to manipulate and control them but at the same time you can't just go around killing everybody and create a new world where none of them exist because i mean that's just a cult and now we see that he took over that religious group well like a form of that religious group and that's what he built his thing off of and obviously we saw gojo when he was brought to near death when he fought toji fushiguru and he was just he was in this complete bliss state and we saw the hollow purple fusing the two the the attraction and the repelling into one move that i don't we still don't know what it even did but we just know that i mean like half of his body was taken clean off and you know that's why we see why gojo is the strongest you know but very very interesting stuff and now i'm am to see what happens or we're gonna stay now in the present and go from there because that's gonna make me smile i'm already smiling but anyways that's gonna be it for me thanks for watching but if you like jutsu kaisen if you like this episode hit the like button subscribe for more keep up to date jujutsu kaisen every single tuesday on time every time hit the notification bell so that you can keep up with everything else and obviously the other episodes are going to be up here somewhere and that's going to be it for me i'm out peace in a bit